What it is, what it do, cyber world. It is your girl, the one and only Ash Said It. Ash Said It.com. Ash Said It.com. Welcome back to the Ash Said It Daily Podcast Show. I appreciate you guys for all of your love and support. Over 1,000 episodes, half a million streams worldwide would not be possible without you guys. So I thank you so very much. Now, if you have not gotten your tickets to Girls Night Out, I don't know what you're doing. It's coming up really soon, less than two weeks away. On June the 7th, 2018, we invade studio movie girl Marietta. And yes, you guys are going to get it. the movie, dinner for the night, and a swag bag full of all kinds of goodies. And one of my favorite restaurants is giving me some gift cards to raffle away. So you're not going to be able to win uh, gift cards to Fogo Deshaun unless you show up. So go to com right now and get your tickets because today I am talking with the regional manager of Fogo Deshaun, Rudimir Bonfara. So, Rudimir, <laughs> yes, thank how you. are you? Thank you for having me. Thank you so much for joining us today. I appreciate that. <laughs> But uh, so let's talk a little bit. Okay, we're talking Fogo de Chon. Where does the story begin with this amazing brand? Sure, um, Ashley. Uh, Fogo de Chon was founded in 1979 in, in a city uh, named Porto Alegre. This is the southernmost state of Brazil. And uh, currently, we have uh, 51 locations throughout Brazil, United States, Mexico, and the Middle East. Uh, so um, our founders uh, were born and raised in, in, the, in the same state. And uh, in 1979, they opened their very first uh, location in Puerto Alegre, and then uh, you know, now we're, we're um, conquering the world. Yes. Now, what I love about you guys is that there are so many options, so many eating options, because me, I've been vegetarian for well over a decade. And I've heard about your brand for a while, and I, I'm honestly, I'm going to be upfront with it. I've avoided you guys because I heard about all the wonderful meats and the porks and everything else that you guys do, and I kind of felt like there wasn't going to be an option for someone who's vegetarian who doesn't eat meat. I do eat seafood and a lot of greenery, but I didn't think that there was going to be an option for me, so... This year, when the opportunity came and I I was able to dine with you all, I was pleasantly surprised to see so much fresh food. I love veggies, and the seafood is amazing. I mean, the the cod. I had I had the sea bass. I had the sea bass, and I had the shrimp, and everything was amazing. And yes, given that the you know you do get the aromas of the meats and stuff, which was I, I was okay with. I was cool with that. But the fact that the I've never had a sea bass that delicate and perfectly cooked, seasoned to perfection, and I was I was I was beyond the moon. <laughs> I was absolutely thrilled to to have this experience with you guys. And so since then, I've been just telling everybody about you guys. I've been promoting it and telling everyone, look, if you don't know about Fogo, you need to go. <laughs> yes, absolutely. And you said it right. Uh, you know, we are, we are mostly known for, for the meat, but, mm-hmm. uh, you know, we definitely have, um, you know, many different options that, you know, different ways that you can enjoy Fogo. You know, one, like you said, the market table, you know, mm-hmm. you know, uh, Seasonal salads, seasonal items that we add, but also uh, over 40 different items there from vegetables, uh, you know, mm-hmm. fresh cut salads. Uh, like you mentioned, the seafood. We have a great mm-hmm. seafood option too for those who, who enjoy seafood. But um, uh, Fogo de specialized, um, you know, for nearly 40 years in, in fire roasting, simple seasoned meats, uh, utilizing the century old um, cooking technique of churrasco. So after by definition is, you know, pretty much any, any steak or grilled meat that you uh, grill over uh, open flame. Mm. And as Fogo, we deliver this authentic Brazilian dining experience to uh, the combination of high-quality high Brazilian cuisine and a unique service model called Rodizio. So this mm. means uh, continuous service. Um, so uh, when you come to Fogo, you'll notice we have chefs uh, walking around the dining room with different customers. 
and, uh, and and that that's pretty much the continuous service and the and the Rhodesia side that we offer here. Okay. Um, in addition to um, to uh, all the other options that we have. Yes, yes. Many, many options, many options. All right, so we're going to take a brief break. When we come back, we're talking more about Fogo de Chão. And I want to talk about some summer items. And, of course, uh, why else are you going to go to Fogo and not hit up the bar? All right? Got some really awesome (laughs) drinks. So, you guys, stay tuned. We will be right back. Did you know that some foods can cause weight gain, body aches, and extreme fatigue? These are just some of the symptoms of food intolerance. Well, what is food intolerance? Food intolerance can occur when the body cannot properly digest certain foods. This can result in acid reflux, migraines, and so many other painful issues. How do you find out what foods are causing this irritation? It's easy. Pinner Test. With half a million satisfied clients worldwide, Pinner Test is the number one way of identifying foods that may be causing discomfort. This simple at-home kit is easy to use with results usually within two weeks via email. It's that simple, all right? What are you waiting for? Go visit pinnertest.com and use my special promo code, Ash Said It, for your discount today. Welcome back to the Ash Said It Daily podcast show. I appreciate you guys so very much. We're talking with the regional manager of one of my favorite, or I say my favorite Brazilian Steakhouse. You guys are it. You guys, you have the title. We're going to go ahead and put a plaque on the wall. You guys have it. I'm sold. <laughs> Foco de shown. <laughs> so we're talking about food items. We're talking about menu changes. So summertime, we're right up on summer. All right. What are some of the menu items that people can look forward to when visiting? So summer, as you know, it's a, it's a great time for, for grilling. So, you know, um, Besides all the different um, meats that we offer here at Fogo and different cuts, mm-hmm. uh, we also have seasonal salads that we uh, that we just launched. One mm-hmm. being our uh, uh, heirloom tomato and mozzarella salad. We also mm-hmm. have a watermelon potato salad, which mm-hmm. are very refreshing, very good. Mm-hmm. Um, but uh, you know we have, uh, uh, like I said, over 40 different salads on the market that you can enjoy. But uh, it's a great time to come and enjoy fresh uh, uh, seasonal cocktails that we make at our bar as well. Uh, or if you, you know, end of the day, leaving work, you want to stop at our bar and uh, enjoy happy hour. We have uh, small bikes as well, um, uh, appetizers, great drinks, uh, great atmosphere. Um, you know, on, on both of our restaurants in Atlanta, that's what I've done with you. So um, definitely many, many different options for you to enjoy our program. Yes. All right. Let's talk about some of those bar items. All right. What are some of those drinks that, that you know, after after work or after I'm in the city somewhere, I'm like, you know what? I need to go Fogo. <laughs> <laughs> so, so what we are written on here at Fogo, our drink, a uh, house drink is called Caipinha, which is basically mm-hmm. a uh, drink that's made with fresh lime, uh, cachaca, which is a sugar cane liquor from Brazil, and sugar, all mixed together, mm-hmm. um, served uh, over ice, very, very refreshing. But for the season now, we have a drink called Guava de Sol, which is made with uh, vodka. Mm-hmm. And, uh, and Prosecco and a little bit of guava and lemon juice. Yeah. Uh, we also have a smoke and honey. Uh, we have a, um, specialty martinis, uh, one being the cucumber uh, mint mash. We also have a one called Tour de Pesta. Uh, so there's definitely, you know, our bar chefs are, are uh, well-trained and, and, and will make all these drinks um, from scratch uh, right in front of you so you can enjoy. So uh, definitely... Um, Yes, and there's so much going on this summer with contests and upcoming events. What does Fogo have to offer this summer? So you know, um, now it's a, it's a, as we know, it's a, it's a great celebration season with uh, graduations. We also have Father Day coming up. Um, you know, we, we do have uh, private rooms in our uh, in our restaurants where we accommodate groups of uh, up to 120 people. Uh, we also have a great open dining room, um, you know, where we can accommodate groups and, and special celebrations. Uh, Father's Day, uh, we are very, very popular mm-hmm. here uh, for Father's Day. Yeah. And um, uh, some of the promotions that we have going on right now, obviously, if you go to forward.com and you uh, register to our e-club to receive uh, news and insights about the restaurant, you immediately get a gift card in there uh, that you can use the next time you come in and dine at Fogo. Mm-hmm. Uh, but we also have something else going on um, uh, right now, where if you dine with us between now and June 17th, 
uh, you gotta give me calls uh, at this time that you can enter for a chance to win a trip for two to Rio and uh, enjoy our restaurant there and uh, really uh, um, a great uh, a great uh, grand prize for you to um, to enter to win. And we also have additional prizes like gift cards for the restaurant. So uh, definitely don't miss the opportunity to come in and visit me and see my your number in there and try to win this, this prize. Okay, so all I heard was you guys want to send me to Rio, and I'm totally on board with that. I'm 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 right there. I'm I'm done. That's, that's it. Let's do it. Udara, thank you so much for joining us today. It has been an absolute pleasure. You are more than welcome back on the program because I know that there's going to be some more stuff going on in and through and after summer. So you know, keep me on your schedule. You know, I know that things are kind of crazy right now but yeah. we're gonna work some things out um thank you so much for having me not a problem yes and let the audience know the best way to get in contact with you guys and of course to make reservations so you know we are uh, you can obviously make reservation online we are on open table uh, so you can go and make reservations but if you like to call the restaurant number is 404 266-9988 and we open every day. Uh, we open from, for lunch from uh, Monday to Friday from 11.30 to 2, dinner from 5 to 10. And then on the weekends, we, we offer brunch uh, from 11.30 to 2, and then dinner from 2 until um, 9 o'clock on Sundays and 10.30 on, on Saturdays. So we open every day. You can call the restaurant anytime or make sure the day is open. Sounds like a plan. All right. I appreciate you guys so very much. Thank you for supporting me, supporting this movement. Keep in mind, anyone to tell you that you can't do what you want to do, you look them square in the face and tell them, don't believe me, just watch. Watch what I do. Watch me make it happen. Watch me make history. That's what we're doing this for. We're doing this for the history books. Social media is nice, but real life is way better. Until next time, you guys.